it is to have your dog get daily exercise and often we consider that to be a walk or maybe throwing ball in the backyard a little bit something of that nature but really it's important that dogs have an opportunity to go outside be off leash and just be able to explode and be exuberant and let all of that extra energy go all of that pent-up energy and that doesn't always happen with the walk or just a little romp in the backyard with a frisbee or a ball so what ken's doing right now with buster and georgia and mellow is playing chuck it which is what they live for this is their opportunity to just go out and go 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 run after the ball sniff the sniff sniff the sniff sniff the smells use their nose and just have a hoot so i'm going to step out of frame just a little bit so that you can watch how george and buster and mellow interact with ken with the ball One of the fun things about playing in this particular location is that the ball often gets hidden, so they really have to use their nose. And one of the things that's fun that we do is we put different scents on the, the tennis balls that we use. And so it really forces them, not, well, not forces them, it encourages them to use their nose and have a little bit more fun. So it's not just looking for where the ball went, but if they do lose where it is, that it's a matter of being able to use their nose and find it. And often we've noticed with Georgia and Buster that when Georgia is looking for it, she's just kind of appears to be random sniffing. But when Buster's looking for it, he does more of a grid search. And it's interesting because they both will come up. So as you can ball. see, we have finished our playing, 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 and our run, run, run. Had a great time. Buster's actually, I think you can see him in shot. He's actually like under my car in the shade. We're right near their favorite mud hole where they get their daily spa treatments. So we'll see if they keep <laughs> trying to get in the mud. You probably will notice that Mello and, and Georgia are just a little bit more brown all of a sudden. They've had their, their spa treatment. One of the things that we always encourage people to make sure of, particularly if you live in an area like Colfax and you take your dogs to a more wooded area where there may be game trails and things, to make sure that when you're done playing, even if you use a flea and tick uh, medication, a topical medication on your dogs, to make sure that you really brush them out well after you get back or even before you get in the car to go home. That way you can make sure that if there are any wayward ticks that may have found their way to your dog, those little op opportunistic vampires, um, that you can get them off. And also too, they may have stickers or burrs or something that they may have come in contact with while running and playing. George is still getting this spot treatment. So make sure you take the time, wash your dog off if necessary, but certainly groom them, check them for any ticks or stickers or anything that may pose a problem for them later on. Thanks, Georgia! Mama no. didn't really need to start a spa treatment, but got one anyways. So, have fun going out and playing with your dogs.